I started this game off doing absolutely everything by myself and I had a wonderful time that I have thoroughly enjoyed my time playing with the crew so far, but if I am to get better at Sea of Thieves, I need to practice. Better practice than charging head on into every single ship I see. So that's what I did today. Loading up on the Galleon's Grave Outpost, I spotted a ship on the horizon and set sail. After chasing them down, it became apparent that they were actually a skeleton crew. Not only one, but a second sloop further along as well. PvE encounter, but an excellent warm-up for the session. Two, two skeleton sloops, yes. Lovely. Fate is smiling upon us now. Got some to join, be free. No, it's cool, dude. I am... Um, actually, this is what I want to do. I want to go by myself a bit. Thanks for the upper though. Oh, I didn't load it! <laughs> oh, I missed on that last one. Storage crate, that's what we're looking for. Gives us a bunch of wooden cannonballs. After sinking the first skeleton crew, emissary I spotted the second on the horizon, but he wasn't alone anymore. It was an emissary vessel heading to their location. If I timed it just right, I could get there while they were in the middle of a fight and sink them both. As I approached the skeleton sloop, it appeared as though the emissary had sailed away, allowing me the opportunity to freely sink the skeleton crew once again. Uh, you run into bastard. Sailing around the map, I spotted another two sloops engaged in a fight, a player and a skeleton crew going toe-to-toe. -to -toe. Another opportunity for me to get my feet wet in the PvP today.
another player sloop appeared in front of me and they anchored at a nearby island. I approached them from the far side using the trees as cover. Set myself up for a devastating broadside attack. spotted yet another player sleep, this time at the Reaper's hideout. Surely he would give me a proper challenge for some PvP practice. Coming into the cove, he dropped his sails and fired his cannons. A real fight was ahead of me this time. We exchanged volleys of cannon fire at each other, the rough seas made him able to Got a couple of hits in and I went wide into the open sea to come about on my starboard side, only to have the unthinkable happen. I had wandered only a couple hundred meters away from shore, but it was enough for the Kraken to stand my ship. I circled my ship, hitting me with a barrage of cannon fire, and as I tried to deal with the Kraken, he ordered me, putting an end to my day's adventure and the prospects of selling any of my loot. An unfortunate series of events to end things off, but at the end of the day, I felt as though my PvP experience had come a long way in terms of naval warfare. But I definitely had a long, long, long way to go for swords and guns. Thanks for watching the video, guys. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like down below. For more CFDs and adventure-styled videos, sub to the channel, and I'll see you in the next one.